Possible solutions for restricted domain. C2. Find all possible values of angle theta rounded to one decimal place for cos theta equals to 0 0.7891 where theta is greater than equal to minus 360 and less than equal to 360 degrees. I am Anil Kumar and in this video let us see how to calculate values of theta when the domain is restricted. Here we have a restricted domain since theta is the values between minus 360 and plus 360. Now when we say cos theta equals to 0 0.7891 one thing is very clear that cos theta is positive. Now if cos theta is positive then what can we conclude about the quadrant? That means that the principal angle theta should lie either in quadrant 1 or in quadrant 4. Correct? This you get from the cos rule. So cos is positive in quadrant 4 and all are positive in quadrant 1. So we are looking forward for two solutions at least for theta. right? So to start with, whenever you are trying to find the angle theta, given trigonometric ratio, in this case we are given cos theta equals to 0 0.7891. First step is figure out quadrants in which the terminal arm should lie to find the value of theta. Now since cos is positive, it is quadrant 1 and quadrant 4. So these are the two quadrants in which theta should be the principal angle theta will be our answer, right? So somewhere here, let us say somewhere here and somewhere there. And of course these twos are the angle, the acute angle thetas, correct? So we need to find these two angles. So let's find that out. Cos theta is equal to 0 0.7891 means theta equals to how much? It is cos inverse of 0 0.7891. So now we can use calculator to find this value. So it is second function shift cos inverse 0 0.7891 bracket close equals to 37.8985. 37.8985. We have to round to one decimal place. We can round this to 37.9 degrees. So that is the value of theta and this value of theta corresponds to quadrant 1. So we get this angle theta as 37.9 degrees. Now how do you find the other angle? Well, in the domain of 0 to 360, the other angle is kind of like this, right? Which means 360 minus 37.9, right? So the other angle should be 360 degrees minus 37.9 degrees, right? So that is the other angle. So we can again use calculator. 360 minus 37.9 which is equal to 322.1. So we get 322.1 degree. Well these are the angles which we have got from 0 to 360 degrees. How do you get the angles between minus 360 and 0? Since we have restricted our domain from minus 360 to plus 360, we need to find all possible answers. Well, to get the answers between minus 360 to 0, what we should do is, we should take away 360 from these two values. Cosine function is a periodic function and the period is 360. That means it repeats after every 360, right? So we already have two solutions. One of them is 37.9, the other one is 322.1. So to get in the interval minus 360 to 0, we should take away 360 from these values. So the other values are 37.9 minus 360 degrees and 322.1 minus 360 degrees. 
So these will give us other two values of theta. So let's do it. We get 37.9 minus 360 equals to minus 322.1 degree and Three twenty two point one minus three sixty degrees gives us minus thirty seven point nine degrees. So these are the other two values. So now we can write down all four answers for theta. So we know theta could be minus three twenty two point one degree or minus thirty seven point nine degree or thirty seven point nine degree or 322.1 degree, right? So these are all the possible solutions. I hope that makes it very clear. Now the other way could have been, so when we have found that the principal angle is 37.9, so that is when you go counterclockwise, this angle is plus 37.9. But when you go clockwise, you can say this angle is minus 37.9 correct so we could have started with plus and minus 37.9 degrees and then if you take away 360 degrees you will get the other two answers as plus and minus 322.1 degree right so anyway this is the way we can do it so first find all your solutions for 0 to 360 and then see by adding or subtracting multiples of 360 all other possible solutions within the given domain as we did here. I hope that helps. Thank you and all the best.